Hi gang, welcome back to Daggy's Toy Box. Dag with you again. Got another Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Out of the Shadows review. This time we have the Shredder. And as you can tell, he's a different take on the character, but really I don't think it's too far off from uh, many other Shredders we've seen throughout the years. If you look back at the uh, original Shredder, at least in the action figure form, well, there wasn't much to him either. I don't think he even had a shirt, if my memory serves me right. He had a little bit more color, uh, some purple, I think, and uh, more claws and spikes, but I don't think that the departure is too far from, uh, too far from home. And actually, it, this figure's kind of growing on me. I think if he had purple cape, it would be really cool. So uh, let's get a 360 look. See he's mostly done in black. Not too bad. So uh, we'll look at articulation. Head can rotate. can also move down and back a little bit. Arms are on a ball joint. Pull his claws off there. He has an elbow joint and the wrist rotates. Nothing in the waist. Legs can move back and forth. Can rotate. Rotate at the knee. And also a knee joint. So, so far in this line, the articulation is not, not too bad. Not too bad at all. So, Shredder's accessories, I'm going to lean them up there for a second. Comes with the, his claws, if you want to call them that. One for each arm. Not too bad. He also comes with this blaster, which I think is a little odd. But it does have, uh, looks like some kind of canister maybe up here in the front. So maybe this shoots mutagen or ooze or something like that. Possibly something that's in the movie, I'm not sure. So counting that, he comes with three accessories. And let me go ahead and snap these claws back on. They just snap onto his arms. Okay, so there's Shredder with all of his accessories. Not too bad. I, I, like I said, it's kind of growing on me. I think that cape, if he would have had the cape, it would have added a whole lot to this figure. And to this design. So here's a size comparison with Rocksteady. Not too bad. Pretty good, I think. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed this look at the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles out of the Shadow Shredder. I, I think I do uh, like this figure pretty good, actually. Not the best shredder ever, but he's pretty cool. That's just my opinion, but I can recommend picking this one up if you're into shredder or heavily into the Ninja Turtle lines. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Please remember to comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll catch you next time.